top of the mountain. Wow, Hannah, we're up really high. Uh-huh, I can see everything from way up here. Look, Emily. What's Robert doing? I think he's looking for Jeff. Then what's Jeff doing? I think he's looking for Robert. Jeff! Robert! Yes? Oh, there you are. I think our game of hide and seek turned into Ring Around the Rosie. Can we play too? That's a super duper idea. <laughs> Oh, oh, I think if you did one more ring around the rosy, I'd fall down on my nosy. <laughs> Would it help if we gave you a big hug? Oh, you just might. <laughs> oh, oh, that's much better. And I've got something to give all of you, too. Does anyone here like presents? Oh, I love presents! Oh, great! Because I've got a special surprise for each of you over here in my closet. What? <laughs> Well, let's see. Cowbell, bowling trophy, boomerang. I thought I threw that out. Tiddly winks. Ah, here they are. Those look like books. They are books. Books about very special people. But, Barney, mm -hmm. mine says all about me. Mm -hmm. So does mine. But there's nothing inside. Well, we'll just have to do something about that. What can we do? A lot. Because these books about very special people are all about you. And you. And you. And you. They are? <laughs> uh-huh. And you can fill the books with some of the things that make you so special. But Barney, what makes us special? Oh, lots of things. It's how you look, the things you do, your family, and a whole lot more. <laughs> there are lots of special people in the world looking different as can be. And there's one I know so very, very well. And that special person is me. <laughs> How are your books coming? Great. The cover says, all about me. <laughs> and then I wrote my name. Robert. <laughs> now I'm coloring in a picture of my hand. Oh, that looks like fun. Is that what you're doing too, Emily? Uh-huh. First I put my hand on the paper. <laughs> then I draw around all my fingers. Oh, oh, let's see. One, two, three, four, five. Oh, you've traced a picture of your whole hand. Now I think I'll color mine green. Oh, that's nice. And for your next page, I think you'll each need one of these. A mirror? Right. 
so you can draw a picture of your very own face. Take a good look. Your eyes might be blue or brown or green or something in between. Maybe you've got a cute little nose <laughs> or a big one like mine. <laughs> look at the color of your hair and your skin and the shape of your smile. There's no other face that's quite like yours. Barney, there are markers and paper on the easel if you'd like to draw a picture, too. Oh, I think I will. <laughs> now, whose face should I draw? <laughs> oh, 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 I know. <laughs> There! All done! Can we see your picture, Barney? Sure you can! <laughs> Ta-da! That's a nice picture of the moon, but it doesn't look like a face. Well, not at first, but keep looking! There was a man lived in the moon, in the moon, in the moon. There was a man lived in the moon, and his name was Aiken Drum. And he played upon a ladle, a ladle, a ladle. He played upon a ladle, and his name was Aiken Drum. Now let's turn the page. Ooh. And his hair was made of spaghetti, spaghetti, spaghetti. And his hair was made of spaghetti, and his name was Aiken Drum. <laughs> <laughs> and his eyes were made of meatballs, meatballs, meatballs. His eyes were made of meatballs, and his name was Aiken Drum. And, and he played upon a ladle, a ladle, a ladle. He played upon a ladle, and his name was Aiken Drum. <laughs> now he needs a nose. Oh. And his nose was made of cheese, cheese, cheese. His nose was made of cheese, and his name was Aiken Drum. And for a mouth. Oh. And his mouth was made of pizza, pizza, pizza. His mouth was made of pizza, and his name was Aiken Drum. There was a man within the moon, in the moon, in the moon. There was a man within the moon, and his name was Aiken Drum. And he played upon a ladle, a ladle, a ladle. He played upon a ladle, and his name was Aiken Drum. <laughs> I can't wait to see your pictures. Here's mine. Oh, oh, I like that. And mine. I know you anywhere. Here's my picture. Oh, it looks just like you. Check out my picture, Barney. Oh, well, it's very, uh, uh Jeffy. <laughs> <laughs> what else can we put in our books? Well, the way you look is just one part of being special. Another is all the fun things you like to do. <laughs> hmm. I like to play soccer. I could draw a picture of that. Oh, good idea. <laughs> I'll draw myself riding a horse. I love horses. <laughs> I like to go camping with my big brothers. I like to collect teddy bears. And I like to roller skate. I don't like to skate. Oh, oh, you don't? Well, I tried it when I was little and I fell down a lot. Hmm. Well, you know, Jeff, some things that were hard to do when you were small will be a lot easier now that you're bigger and stronger. Sure will be. <laughs> do you really think I can do it? Well, I know a fun way to find out. Oh, come on. Oh, here comes. Okay. Ready? Here we go. Would you like to skate? Give it a try. Don't hesitate. Me, oh my. Give it a try, and when you're done, you might find out you had some fun. When you try to do something new, you might be surprised at what you like to do. Do de do de do, you might like something new. <laughs> new food on your plate, give it a try. Time for a taste, me oh my. Give it a try, and at the end, you might even try it again. When you try to do something new, you might be surprised at what you like to do. Do de do de do, you might like something new. Hey, oh, that's it. Good job. Oh, yeah. A new game to play. Give it a try, a new word to say. Me, oh my. 
give it a try And when you're done, you might find out you had some fun When you try to do something new You might be surprised at what you like to do 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 You might like something new I like it Do 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 You might like something new <laughs> you look great on skates. Thank you, Barney. <laughs> How many pages should we fill in? Well, as many as you want. I'm sure you each like lots of different things. 33, 34, <laughs> 35, 36, 37. What are you counting, Hannah? All these piano keys. I was going to draw a picture of myself playing the piano. Making music is something special. But I didn't know you could play the piano. Well, I just started taking lessons, but my Grammy Johansson taught me a song. Oh. Want to hear it? Oh, I'd love to. <laughs> Chopsticks. I know how to play that. Want to play it together? Okay. Oh, boy. room for him to play with us. Oh, that's all right. <laughs> I thought I'd play along on my tuba. <laughs> Ready? One, two, three. about my family, too? Oh, of course you can. Your family's one of the things that makes you special. I think I'll write about my mom and dad and my brother and sister. Hmm. I don't have any brothers or sisters, but my grandparents have a farm. I could draw some pictures of that. Oh, sounds like fun. At my house, there's me, my dad, my brother, and Tiger. A uh, tiger? <laughs> no, he's just a cat. His name is Tiger. Oh. <laughs> My parents say we've got a house full of boys, me and my two brothers. And do you know what my brother Julio's favorite game is? No, what is it? No, what is it? Your brother's favorite game. Your brother's favorite game. Hey, you're saying everything she says. Hey, you're saying everything she says. That must be the game. That must be the game. You can stop now, Robert. You can stop now, Robert. Oh, my. <laughs> Peter Piper picked a peck of pickled peppers. A peck of pickled peppers, Peter Piper picked. If Peter Piper picked a peck of pickled peppers, where's the peck of pickled peppers, Peter Piper picked? Peter Piper peep a peck of pickled peppers. Peter Piper pick a peck of... Peter Piper pick a peck of... Peter Piper pick a... I was trying to be just like you, but it was too hard. Oh, look! Stella! Stella? <laughs> Salam alaikum marhaba! Salam alaikum marhaba? Salam alaikum marhaba. That means hello in Arabic. I'm sorry, but you won't fit through the door. Now you wait right there till I get back. I've just come from Cairo, Egypt, where I was taking a donkey ride around the pyramids. The pyramids? That's right. I have a picture postcard. Whoa, that is cool. Oh, look at that. Well, there I was on that donkey when I thought I heard someone say, I was trying to be just like you. And that reminded me of a story. Can we hear it? Yes, you can. <laughs> but I'm going to need some helpers. <laughs> Once upon a time, 
there was a farmer who had a donkey. Hee-haw! Hee-haw! It's been a long day. I guess I'll go inside to rest. Hee-haw! Sorry, donkey. You can't come inside. I'll see you tomorrow. Hee-haw! Oh, I think he's <laughs> sad. The donkey wanted to know what happened in the farmer's house at night. So he looked in the window. And he saw the farmer playing with her sweet little pet cat. Hee-haw! I think the farmer loves the cat more than me. But why? The cat rubs against the farmer. Oh, nice kitty. And the cat chases mice. Oh, good kitty. And the cat drinks milk from the table. Oh, clever kitty. If I do all those things, the farmer will love me too. Yee-haw! So the donkey came running through the door. Yee-haw! I mean, meow! He tried to rub against the farmer, but he was too strong. He tried chasing a mouse. Meow, meow! But he was too big. <laughs> And last, that donkey tried to drink the milk from the table. He was much too big. Donkey, what are you doing? I thought if I acted like the cat, you'd love me too. Old friend, you're a wonderful donkey, but not a very good cat. So if you want me to love you, just be yourself. Meow. I mean, eehaw. Lesson of the story is to be your best, be yourself. <laughs> yeah, that was a really good story, Stella. Why, thank you, Emily. <laughs> <laughs> There's my ride. I better be going. Okay. So, as they say in Egypt, ma salama, and that means hey, goodbye. That's right. <laughs> Bye, Stella. Bye, Bye, Stella. Bye, Stella. Bye. <laughs> I'm gonna write about Stella's story in my book. Mm -hmm. Me too. I'm gonna write Be Yourself. Good. Mm -hmm. Of course, even when you're being yourself, you still mm -hmm. change a little bit every day. We do? Uh-huh. And someday you'll all be grown-ups with grown-up jobs. I've got an idea. We've got lots of costumes in the treehouse. We can all dress up and pretend what our jobs will be. <laughs> yeah. And I can get my camera to take pictures to go in your book. So oh, oh, this is going to be great. Okay. <laughs> Ready when you are. <laughs> Boy. Oh, these are going to look great. <laughs> what I want to be. What I want to be when I grow up to be big me. What I want to be, what I want to be is a doctor or a school teacher. Each day I work what fun it will be. I'll always do my responsibility. I'll do what I do so carefully when I grow up to be big me. Good. Next, please. to be when I grow up to be big me. What I want to be, what I want to be is a farmer or a firefighter. Each day I work what fun it will be. I'll always do my responsibility. I'll do what I do so carefully when I grow up to be big me. Doctor, school teacher, farmer, about done. So am I. Thanks for the pictures, Barney. You're very welcome. There we go. Wow, there's a lot in here. Well, I'm not surprised. After all, you're each special in so many ways. <laughs>
You are special, you're the only one, you're the only one like you. There isn't another in the whole wide world who can do the things you do. Cause you are special, special. Everyone is special. Everyone in his or her own way. Oh, you are special, special. Everyone is special. Robert, I think you're very special because you're such a good friend to others, always being helpful. Thanks, Barney. <laughs> and Hannah, it seems like you always have wonderful ideas for fun things we can all do together. And that's very special, too. Thank you, Barney. <laughs> you're important, though you really are. You're the only one like you. The world is better just because you're here. You should know that we love you. Because you are special. I think you're special because whatever you're doing, you always try to do your best. Thanks a lot, Barney. And Emily, your smile is like a ray of sunshine that makes all of us happy every day. And that's very special indeed. Thanks, Barney. Because <laughs> you are special, special. have some empty pages in my book. And that's a very good thing. Those pages are for tomorrow, and the day after tomorrow, and the days after that. You can fill them in as you go to new places and do new things. Barney, <laughs> we have a surprise for you. Oh, you do? Here, we made a book for you, too. <laughs> oh, it's wonderful. Thank you. See, it's all about you, Barney. Oh, it's great. <laughs> Look at the rainbow. Look at this. There's Jeff. We all helped make it. Oh. Because we think you're special too. Oh, thank you. I love you. You love me. We're a happy family with a great big hug and a kiss from me to you. Won't you say you love me too? Good idea. Let's show our books to the other kids. And we can show them how to make some of their own. Thanks for the books, Barney. And for all the fun. You're welcome. Bye bye. 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 See you bye. 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 It was a really special day. See you tomorrow. To all my friends, I'm glad you came to play. Our fun and learning never end. Here's what we did today. Our friends made books about some very special people. Themselves. <laughs> and there are lots of things that make you special too. The way you look. The things you like to do. And the new things you try. 
Stella's story told us that it's good to be yourself instead of acting like someone else. You're special because of your family and friends and who you're going to grow up to be someday. And remember, a 